Today in this video, I'm about to show y'all the most overpowered historic player in NBA 2K24. Now, if you missed this video on my channel, how to unlock the historic teams or all-time team, make sure you check it out in my channel so you don't miss it. But now, this is, I'm gonna show y'all the bonus. This is Kawhi Leonard, but really it's a top 10, but the bonus is Kawhi Leonard because, because people sleep on this Kawhi Leonard. Now, like he's 96 overall or 97, doesn't matter. And then, I ain't gonna go through the whole attribute, but we're gonna go through the bash it because that's more important. So he got an 83 ball, that's important. You need a three ball in this game. Now he got 47 total badges, got Challenger Hall of Fame, Clancy Hall of Fame, Glove, right state ripper means you use the right state to strip. 94 feet means that you can pressure down the court. Asian three means that you can shoot a difficult shot, gold blindness, clean more, dead eye. This Kawhi Leonard right here is a problem, especially a guy like off ball, and you're going against a Kawhi Leonard, he's very OP, it's very hard to blow by that man. Unless. Unless your point guard or your shooting guards move very fast like Kobe Bryant or LeBron and things like that, then you're able to um, pass Kawhi, but not that often because he's one of the best two-way players next to Michael Jordan and Kobe Bryant. So look at these badges, he's got nothing but gold, silver, you know, all kind of stuff. So let's move on to the next. All right, number 10, you gotta go with Derrick Rose, the 2011 Bulls version, because he's a 95 overall, he moves fast. I think he got a 99 speed, but let's go to the speed, huh? I'm not sure. But let's see, let's see right here, because I don't wanna waste any time. Yeah, he do got a 99 speed, and, and ball handle, 99 speed, I mean, 99 ball handle, and things like that. Speed with ball, let me see speed with ball. Speed with ball, with speed with ball. Yeah, 99, so he moves so quick. Now, we'll go over the bashes real quick. He got total badges of 40. Look, Acrobat Hall of Fame, Blow by Hall of Fame, Bunny, Comeback Kid, Finisher, Floor Game, me, you do the Flow to Whatever, Hyper Drive, Pro Touch, Scoop, but this guy right here is, is very OP. He got a lot of Hall of Fame badges. A lot, of, a lot of today's players don't have that. So you play with historic teams, this is, this is it because he's very OP. Look at this, Hall of Fame Speed Booster. I forgot to mention that. It's almost like Chris first, spe uh, Chris first step, but you move very fast. So it's really hard to guard this man. And he don't have real, he can shoot a three ball. I think his three balls are 83. We're not gonna look at that. But what's his goal? Goal, Pulse of Waza. This dude right here, that Rose is different. It's a reason why he won the 2011 MVP. All right, next, you got Larry Bird. Oh man, this guy right here is 6'9". And he could, he's one of the best shooter next to Steph Curry. Before he was number one, but now he's like number two and number three based on an opinion. But my opinion, this bird right here in this game is hard to contest him because he's very tall and he's deadly from the three point range and mid range. So especially in this game today, in 2K24, is all about the mid range game. So you got that down pat, you agree in 90% of the time. Now, you already know his defense is lacking, but they say he's a two way. Diamond three level score, you know, hey, that's a crazy build for a Larry Bird. So we're gonna go through a whole, um, go through the badges with total badges of 49. Hall of Fame blindness, catch and shoot, clean more, corner specialist, dead eye. You can't leave this man open at all. Hall of Fame limited range. Like he's like a total version of Seth Curry, but he's just a, he just don't got no handle. So that's the only problem. But acrobat, he can move if you know how to move with him. You gotta have a, a skill to use Larry Bird. If you have the skill to use use Larry Bird, he become OP or overpowered. Look at this. All this is go, 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 whistle, workhorse, 94 feet. This dude is a problem, man. This Larry Bird is crazy, man. All right, number eight, you gotta go with the 2008 Nuggets version of Car Carmel Anthony because he's a 92 overall. He's three balls at 80. It could be like an 85, doesn't matter. His mid range is a, is a 97. That means it's money every time. You could do like post up, you could do the hot step jumper from the from the three point line, mid range, and the post. Like, he is unstoppable. And stop, unstoppable. Plus, he can move very fast. They gave him a speed booster of a silver. We're gonna go through the badges right now. He got a total badge of 40, Asian 3, Dead Eye, Midi Magician, Acrobat. You know, he got Wizard, he got Anchor Breaker. Since when Carmen and Andy bring Anchors, but we, that makes him OP because he's 6'7. Or, I don't know why they made him 6'7, he's 6'8. They always change the height in 2K. I don't know why. Like, he really 6'8. I don't know why they put him 6'7. But anyway, Claymore, you got a comeback kid. I'm going to show you how the speed boost. Look, look, he got limited range on gold. Like, this middle right here is OP. You cannot afford to leave him open, man. You got to learn how to use this, man. This guy is very OP, the Nuggets version. Sometimes the next depends on the situation. But this speed boost right here, like, 
it's like a quick quick first step. They took it out the game. I don't know why. Quick, quick first step is part of the game. But we want to call that a speed boost. So he got that on silver. So he able to move quick. All right, number seven, you gotta go with Shaq, the 2001 Lakers version, because he's 97 overall. And Shaq is just straight diamond. Everybody knows that. Even though he got a tall badge or 29, I don't know why. He supposed to have way more than that, but let's go through the badges because yeah, we know Shaq we could do, but you're gonna go through the badges because a lot of people don't know about badges and a lot of casuals just hop on the game and just play. Now, you go to Unc you're gonna Encore Hall of Fame, a Rizzo Hall of Fame, Back Down Punch Hall of Fame, Back Down Beast, Hall of Fame, Hall of Fame Brick Wall, Bulldozer, Challenger, um, Draw Step, you know, that's his favorite move. And he got a Masher, Masher in the Paint, Wise Up, Whistle. I'm surprised he don't have Hall of Fame Postal Wise Up. 2K is so disrespectful. Post Lockdown, okay, that's cool. Post post, uh, post Spin Technician, I don't know why that's on Gold, but okay. Look, Postal Wise on Gold, that's supposed to be Hall of Fame. But you know, it is what it is. Maybe time to nerf Shaq a little bit. If they get Shaq glo a glove on Braun, like he don't even still wall. Like maybe passing leads. All right, number six, you gotta go. You gotta go with Kobe Bryant. Not only he could score, but also he could play defense. He's a nine-time All for defensive team in NBA history. It, and they call him the two-way, three-level shot creator. He got a total badge of 57. Oh man, three balls, 79. Midway is 94. You already know his own ball defense. I don't feel like going all that. But you're going to go through the badges because badges is very important, man. Attributes is important too, but not important as badges because you got to know this. If you um, if you plan on playing this game, you got to know what you're doing. You got to know what you're going up against and things like that. Look, look for example, like Hall of Fame, Dead Eye, and all that, catch and shoot, Asian threes. That means that you can shoot a difficult shot from the three point range, mini magician. Mid, um, Hall of Fame, that's money. Like, you able to green it. It don't matter what defense you're playing. It depends if the opponent playing on ball. If he don't, you still going to score because that's Kobe Bryant right there, man. And you know they're going to make him OP because he's in the cover. He's a cover athlete. You know, rest in peace to Kobe. It's, it's sad right now. It's crazy. But Kobe Bryant right here is OP as hell, man. Especially his jump shot is very fast. So, you shoot with him, you would time at 90% of the time. Quick jumpers usually, like, beat the defense. But a slow jumper, nah. But Kobe Bryant got a fast jumper, so he's not gonna get contested that often if you give him a little bit of space. All right, number five, you gotta go with the 2016 Golden State Warriors version of Stephen Curry. Now he's a nice and overall, but the current, the current um, Steph Curry, like he's downgraded a little bit because he's getting older, and they gave him like a speed booster on on silver. But this one right here, he moves so fast, they get him go. You're not gonna, it's very hard to guard him. He got a 99 three ball, you know what time it is. It is, it is say, Curry's a two way. He's not a two way player, that's cap. First, and then we're gonna go to um total badger of 50. So we're gonna go there. And look, he got Asian threes, blindness, Hall of Fame, comeback kid, dead eye, guard up, go, uh, Hall of Fame, limitless range, Hall of Fame. You know that's Hall of Fame. Imagine getting Steph Curry a silver limitless range. That would be so stupid. Ain't gonna break up and go. Blow by, bunny, catch and shoot. You, you know what time it is. This right here is the key right here. Compared to the current version of Steph Curry. Look, go speed booster, man. He gonna move so fast. Really, especially if dudes is massive with the pick and roll. It's gonna be hard to guard him. I'm telling you, it don't matter who you are. You could use Michael Jordan, Kawhi, um, Giannis to guard him, LeBron. Doesn't matter. Use the screen and he know the moves, the curry slide, all that. It's over. Because he moves too damn fast. Especially getting him to pull play animations. It's different. All right, next you got the 2017 Warriors version of Kevin Durant. Really, it doesn't matter if the Thunder version of 2012, they both is practically the same. But you know, at the end of the day, they both in their prime. So I don't, I don't know who OP, I'm gonna say both. So he got the 883 ball. What makes him OP is that he got two Hall of Fame badges. I don't know why. He got blindness, he got bulldozer for gold. Bulldozer for gold? Yo, Durant is weak. They give him gold badges for that. I understand a bronze, that makes sense. But that's not his style of play. So that right there, they're trying to make him OP. But that's the reason why I put on my that I put him on the list because of that. But anyway, look. Limited range, gold. So this Denver, this Denver, Kevin Durant is a problem right here. KD? Oh man, forget about it. And look, I'm gonna show y'all a secret. Look, silver, speed booster, silver. He able to to uh, speed boot off the dribble or or hesitation, whatever moves you do, he gonna speed boost really fast for his height, for 6'10". 
So that makes him OP. He's on this list. All right, next you gotta go with Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. This man right here is very OP, especially at tier three, because it's not a lot of centers that can compete with him, other than Will Chamberlain. But other than that, this dude's OP is really hard to stop. It, uh, matter of fact, it don't even matter what center you put on him. Kareem is Kareem. He's gonna do his number, especially if the Scott Hook is OP. If you're not the time to Scott Hook, it's going in every time. Look, Scott, the, the, the post hook is 99, post fade 94. Block shots, you already know the rest, but we're gonna go through the badges. Anchor, Hall of Fame, Dream Shake, Hall of Fame, Drop Set, Hall of Fame, Hook Specialist, Hall of Fame. It's green every time. Mash it in the paint. Me means play bully ball and stuff like that. Post, post fade phenom. Post lockdown. Post spin technician. Like, y'all tell me that's not OP? I don't know what is. And look, bulldoze and gold. Gold brick wall. Challenger, gold. Like, look at this. Post it, gold. Rebound chaser, gold. Like, he, he, he grabbed more rebounds than shot. In my opinion, like that's crazy. Like he grabbed more rebounds than Shaq in this game. All right, next you gotta go with Michael Jordan, 99 overall. His three balls, 84. Main range, 99. A lot of people got an issue with his jumper, but make it faster. That way you can time his jump jump shot, like set point and things like that. Don't put it on push because you want you want to get contested every time you shoot with Michael Jordan. You don't want that. But you got post fade 97. But you know, everybody know Michael Jordan. He got total badges of 63. A two-way, one, one of the best two-way players of all time. Like, and he got a lot of Hall of Fame badges. This Michael Jordan right here is a problem. That 96 bull version. I'm gonna get a 93 bulls a slot uh, a slide there because nobody don't really use that thing because it's like a uh, floor spacing. But this thing right here, this Michael Jordan, best version, catch shoe, Hall of Fame challenger, clam, dead eye. You get Michael Jordan and Dale Hall of Fame, it's a problem. Fast Trish, Fairless Finisher, Flow again. Nobody doing no flow with Michael Jordan. What the hell? Wait, time out. Michael Jordan got a Hall of Fame limit his range. Yeah, 2K, 2K is cheesing with Michael Jordan. He don't shoot, he don't shoot those in real life, but they want to make him OP. This is why I put him on the list. You can shoot on limit his range with Michael Jordan from far distance. That's crazy, man. That that is that is cheese automatically. Pick Dodger, Hall of Fame, Paul Touch, Scooper, Silby Finisher. You got Space Creator. All oh, this is Hall of Fame. This is Michael Jordan. What do you expect? Michael Jordan. Comeback Kid. Giant Slayer. Glove. Oh, man. Michael Jordan, Michael Jordan, Michael Jordan. Michael Jordan. Gold Postal Visor. Position Dunk. It means that you time your dunk using an analog stick. I press it down and then up. Look at this. Speed Boost. Look. Speed Boost on Gold, man. This Michael Jordan is OP, man. You will have to double team this man on Trap or Play Zone or something, man. 1-1 one -one with Michael Jordan is a problem. All right, man, the, number one is LeBron James. This LeBron James right here, OP, man, 6'9". Look at this three boy, 88, main range 87. We ain't gonna go through the attribute. You already know what time it is. And you know, he got a, uh, a 94 speed. He got a 94 speed, and he got a total badge of 66 next to Michael Jordan, man. This is crazy. Hey, look, challenge your Hall of Fame. Chase down artists, claim more. This LeBron James is all around beast. Especially you five out with this team with Miami Heat with Chris Bosch at the center position, it's over. Cause he's gonna bully you all day long. All day long. Look, look, Hall of Fame poster wise open looks, needle threader, pro touch, scooper. I don't think LeBron do scoop. Wait, where's Bulldozer at? I think I saw it on Hall of Fame. No? So not I think he had it on goal, and I'm not mistaken. Look. Asian threes, bail out. Oh my goodness. Yeah, bulldoze on goal, but Kevin Durant got bulldoze on goal too. But who's stronger? Hmm, make that make sense, 2K. But anyway, like I said, this LeBron James right here is a problem, man. This is his best year throughout his whole career. This is his best year. And that's his best year. You gotta give him a lot of best badges in this game. Polo stick, gold. Like, this is crazy. Like, special delivery, space creator. Let me see, he got any spoop on, on speed booster right here. I think he had it on silver, speed booster. It's like a quick first step. Let me see something real quick. No. Wait, he got limits range on, on, on bronze? Wait, where's Speed Booster at? I could've sworn I saw it. He don't have it? 